Speaking of team captain, speaking of team captain, uh oh, <laughs> you see what Tom Brady said at the White House? Did you see it? Yes, <laughs> yes, I did. Tom Brady went from the goat in my mind to just like absolute <laughs> coolest person ever. He he's he's the coolest dude. Yeah. He's, the coolest. he's hit his stride in his mid forties. That's what I'm trying Brendan, to do. He's still meet Brendan. That's he's what I'm trying still, to do. He's still on this rocket ship. Yeah, that's what I'm trying to do, man. Okay? This guy this guy is a sort of Richard Branson and Jeff Bezos right now yeah. of life at 40. Yeah. 44. 44. He, he's still, that joke he made, in the delivery and just, it was classic. Yes. And it was so good, even Joe Biden had to like nod and laugh. Yes. It's so like, good. And what he say? He was like, he's like, yeah, you know, a lot of people didn't think we could do this. A lot of people didn't think that we could come back here and win a Super Bowl. Like, I would say like 40% of the people, which is basically the same amount of people that didn't think you actually won the election. <laughs> His delivery. And the funny thing is, is that Tom Brady is in that 40%. <laughs> <laughs> Hilarious. It was, it, it was, it was hilarious. Yeah. It, it, and, I, and I think it was actually why, you know, you go to this this random political wonkies like us actually watch this stuff. But it was why I was even disappointed that that Trump decided not to participate in the correspondence dinners. Yeah. Because I think that they're so funny. There, it, like, we, like at some point, like, let's not take ourselves too serious. That, like, let's, let's, that's, that's the let's, point I'm getting Let's to. have a couple jokes on each on other people's behalf. That's like, the point I'm getting that's at. funny. Can we laugh, please? Yeah, yeah. We said it a lot. Can we just laugh? Yeah. Can we have a good time? Can we like laugh about some of this stuff? Yeah, it's so serious. Yeah, so it's so serious. Why so serious? <laughs> why so serious? <laughs> you know, like yeah. why are we? So, why so serious? Yeah, yeah. I was like Tom Brady doing that mild thing. It was just like that brought guy some le- brought some it, levity to it, to it, the situation. It, it brought some levity to all this. And you know what else I liked about it? And this goes to show you how. We really have to be, I am consistent with what I've said about this once again for all sports and all athletes. And I'll be consistent about saying this about me. If Joe Biden invites me to the White House now, I'm going. He's a president of the United States. Yeah, he's POTUS. Like, he's a, I served in the Obama administration as a White House fellow. Yes. When I was appointed, as I was very proud to serve and very proud to get a call and appointment from the president of the United States. I have had a problem with every one of the sports teams that decided to just not show up for Donald Trump. Ridiculous. And why did I have a problem with that? Yeah. Because it's it's the president. It's the president of the United States, right? And like that's a part of the pageantry and being able to to win and that's what, you know what I appreciate about Tom Brady? Tom Brady doesn't have to be a Biden guy. He was there. He was there. And we know he's a Trump it's a guy. Trip to the, and we know he's a Trump it's a trip guy, to by the, the way. White, it's a trip to the White House there. in honor of what you were able to accomplish you, with your teammates. As a team. 